we can add multiples of 100. So here we have 300 plus 200. You can see that the total is 500, because if we know that 3 plus 2 is 5, we know that 300 plus 200 is 500. So what is 400 plus 400? Well, there are 400s, and there's another 400s. So now we have a total of 800. We know that 4 plus 4 is 8, so we know that 400 plus 400 is 800. Now let's look at subtracting multiples of 100. Here we have 300, and if we subtract 100, we now have 200. So if we know that 3 minus 1 equals 2, we know that 300 minus 100 equals 200. So what is 600 minus 200? If we take away 200, that leaves us with 400. And because we know that 6 minus 2 is 4, we know that 600 minus 200 is 400.